Okay, thanks, Teresa. All right, have you figured it out yet? Syllabus thing? All right, well, we're going to answer the question right after the break. Welcome back. All right, we've made you wait long enough. Okay, so everybody has their own kind of thing they collect, right? Well, Eastern eggs go hand in hand. So when we had a chance to interview a local facilivist, what better time to do so than leading up to Easter? Her name, Rita Michelson, I'm going to say, but it's, I'm saying that wrong. I know Teresa's shaking her head at me. Mickelson, thank you, is the facilivist. And she was kind enough to tour Teresa and Cameron and Terry through her collection of, da 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 da, egg cups. These are a set. I really like them actually. The heads come off, they're salt and pepper shakers, and then the egg goes in here, and you put this back up again. These are probably one of my favorites. It's also something that my husband gave me, so it's special. I like the captain and the pirate. The quails, they're probably one of my favorites. You said they were older? I would say probably 1920s, 1930s. Um, now tell me, please, that yes. at, at least that you like to eat hard-boiled eggs. Yes, hard I do, eggs. but not that often. <laughs> I've got about 2,000 more than that. So. 2,000 egg cups more yeah. than this? Yeah. No, no, 2,000 in all. 2,000 all counting. together? Yeah. Okay, so, and you have a cupboard full. Yes. This but is one cupboard. This is one cupboard full. So we're going to go and see the, 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 other the, next, the other three yeah. cupboards. How did this start? I have a brother in Holland who used to collect egg cups about 35 years ago, and I really liked the idea. So, off I went and got more egg cups, and egg cups, and egg cups. <laughs> and then, of course, once people find out that you like to collect, I get them, yeah. then you get and those are very special. So here we have cupboard number three. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at this Garfield. He's wonderful. There are cats. All kinds. Cows. Yeah. From all around the world. From all, yeah. Okay, and then behind on the other in the corner is cupboard number four, which is... That's cupboard number... This is cupboard number two. That's cupboard number this three. This is actually cupboard three. And four is over there. This... Oh, what a beautiful case. Bouquet. And Peter made extra shelves so I can display my cupboards or my egg cups a bit better. So are you satisfied with how your egg cups are displayed? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Mm -hmm. I like them covered this way I don't have to dust them. Oh, my gosh. Dusting is not my um, favorite. It is highly overrated. Yes. So tell me about some of the special ones that you pulled out. Um, here oh. on cupboard number three. This one. It's Bancroft. has Bancroft on it. From Bancroft, Ontario. Do you yeah. know how old this uh, egg cup I is? I would assume, i say about 40, 50 years old. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. These are two whistles. Tell me. Show me how they work. Oh. <laughs> this is to help the children eat their egg a bit more. Now, where, how, where are these from? And I notice I'm being very careful in how I move them. Um, these ones I got at an auction sale. And how old are they, do you think? Uh, probably 1800, early 1900. And these two are your favorites. Why? Oh, because they are I old. Like this them. is old They're style. Really old. Mickey is my favorite. Popeye is my favorite. It's actually very hard to say which one I like better and which one I don't. They're all special. Now, um, do you use them? No. Not to No? We have separate ones that we use. <laughs> I wonder which one she sleeps with. Okay, Dr. Dog, wet your appetite to hit the golf greens before you start swinging last week.